Got a numbered list, but you want to add other types of non-numbered paragraphs in the middle of the list? It's easy to do if you follow the steps in this video. If you are working with numbered lists in your document, you already know that the numbered list is nothing more than a series of numbered paragraphs. There may be times when you want to have a paragraph or two in the middle of a list, and then have numbering pick back up after the unnumbered paragraphs. There are two primary ways that you can accomplish this. One method involves the numbering tool, and the other involves ordinary editing techniques. You want to go ahead and select all the paragraphs that you want to have numbered. In this case, we're going to select all of these, including the two paragraphs in the middle that we don't want to have included in the list. Now we're going to go ahead and click on the uh, numbered list tool, the numbering tool, right up here on the home tab of the ribbon. And when we do, you can see that you have paragraphs one through six that are numbered. Now all I have to do is go ahead and select the paragraphs that I don't want to have numbered in this list, and I can go ahead and click on the numbering tool one more time, and you can see that they no longer have numbers on them, but the numbering is continued. It has one, two, and then three, four at the end. In other words, the numbering sequence continues with the paragraph following those that you selected. In order to modify these paragraph numbering options using editing techniques, we want to go ahead and select the paragraphs that we're going to number, just like we did before. And then I'm going to click on the numbering tool right up here. Notice that the paragraphs that we don't want numbered are numbered at the current time, but we're going to take care of that. We do that by placing the insertion point right here at the beginning of the paragraph that we want to not have included in the numbered list. And all I'm going to do at this point is press the backspace key. Notice when I did that the number disappeared from in front of that paragraph and the numbering was resequenced for the entire list. Now I can go down to the next one. And again, I'm at the very beginning of that paragraph and I press the backspace key again. And you can see that these two paragraphs are no longer included in the numbering of the list itself. You need to understand that there's a major difference in the effect of this approach and the previous approach from earlier in this video. In this second approach, the numbering is removed, as you can see on the screen, but the indent of the paragraphs remains the same as the other paragraphs in the numbered list. In the first approach, the numbering is removed but the paragraph indent is returned to what it was before you created the numbered list. So which option should you select? It depends on how you want the paragraphs to look that are within the middle of your numbered list. I hope you found this video helpful. If you did, make sure you click the subscribe button and then click the bell icon. That way YouTube will let you know whenever I add a new video to the Word Tips channel. Thanks for spending a few minutes with me today. Thank <laughs> you.